new game just come out today it is Mafia 1 Remake which also known as Mafia Definitive Edition so I hope you enjoy if you do enjoy make sure to like hit that like button and also subscribe because I'll be doing to try and do a full series on this game depending on how many likes I get on this video so let's just sort all this out quickly let's put this on regular 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 tutorials just, we'll just put it on show for now right let's get into it Tommy, Thomas Angelo, Detective Norman. You alone? <laughs> no self-respecting badges coming in here unless it's the health inspector. What can I get you? Ah, just a coffee, thanks. Dip your beak. No thanks. Suit yourself. So yeah. Said on the phone, you might have a proposition for me. That's right. But if you're looking to set up a gravy train, you call the wrong cop. I'm not looking for any uh, associates. Good. Because I'm on the nut. 
can't even pay for the coffee. But I got plenty to trade. Well, that's yours. How long you been in town? Three years. Caught my teeth in Empire Bay. Well, they handed you the Morello case. Right out of the gate. That's what the paper says, ain't it? And what's it to you? Tough break. Case must be getting pretty cold by now. Or you got something might warm it up. Yeah, I might have some. And what's my end of the deal? Uh, you want money? Some sort of immunity? None of that. I got people I need to protect. Ah, families. Always the Achilles heel, ain't it? So who you got? A sick ma or a wife and a litter of kids? Wife and daughter. And no one else to watch your back, I'm guessing. Wouldn't be here otherwise. Pity that. Pa always said a man needs friends if he's going to survive in this world. Yeah. Well, in my world, it's the other way around. No surprise there. Look, I can't promise anything for your family, not until I hear what you're trading. So, are you talking? Or are you just killing time before they come for you? You think I'm on the run? <laughs> oh, I know it, Tommy. Jesus, look at you. Surely gassed. You haven't slept for days. And your neck's got to be aching from all that looking over your shoulder you're doing. No, the way I figure it is, you got someone powerful mean on your tail, and they ain't giving up until you end up in the river. And you walk out that door without me, we both know you're not making it five steps. Boss, yeah, you stick around, you tell me your story, and maybe you got a shot at living long enough to walk that girl of yours down the aisle. Either way, it looks like I'm buying you a cup of coffee. Christ, I don't know how everything got so balled up. No one ever sees the hair pen until it's too late. But you didn't get handed a heater in the nursery, did you? No. I was a cab driver back in 30. I mostly drove nights, because the money was better. It was at the end of one of those shifts, when I first met Polly and Sam. Shit! Okay, let's go. Let's see what the handling legs on this game, be honest. Doesn't really tell you which way we're going. Oh, what do you It's quite hard to drive on this game. It's pretty hard to get, probably get used to it after a while. Holy shit! Oh, okay. I think I'll take the slow down, yeah, normal, sort of. Like Holy shit! So they've just made the people. Where am I taking you once we're over the bridge? I'm getting tired out of questions. I'm gonna try not to talk for the when people I talk around in the game, to be honest. I 
Let's go up for the Oh, we're gonna cut through that. Out of this area, because there's a lot of people in this way, really. Holy shit! Oh yeah! Cut these motherfuckers! I'm still one by in this. So our bridge is going up, I wonder if I can go that way. Let's try it. Let's go! Yeah, so this is up now. I think you just sit tight. We talk it through back at the bar. I thought I was about to say, yes, this game is made by the people who made Mafia 3. I think they're called 2K games. So uh, I'm hoping that this game is a bit like that one. Compensation for your services. Any damage to your car. This makes us square. I'm sure it's more than enough. Good. Don Salieri wants you to know that he's very grateful. So if you ever need anything, maybe a loan, or some honest work, don't hesitate to ask. Don doesn't forget his friends. Yeah, okay, thanks. One more thing. This matter stays between us. Anyone asks where you got that money, you want it at poker. The scratches on your car, you swerved to keep from hitting a little old lady. You got it? No, of course. See you around, kid. Envelope. I could have had a heart attack. Enough to fix the cap. <laughs> Nearly enough to buy a new one. I thought about what Sam said about work. I wasn't interested. The money was good, sure, but I didn't want to get in with criminals. Better to be poor and alive than rich and dead. So, right there, back then, I was out.
After that night with Celieri's guys, I was back working as soon as I could. But it felt different. You get a lot of time with your thoughts when you're a cabbie. And other people's thoughts, too. You there. Driver? Yes, ma'am. Are you driving or loitering? Driving, ma'am. Always driving. Right, so we've got to take her wherever she wants to go or whatever. I'm sorry if the audio is a bit rubbish, but it's because when I'm wearing the headphones to talk to everyone on the mic, the audio seems to always go a bit strange, to be honest. Speed limiter. I'm guessing we've got to keep the speed limit on, to be honest. Turn the racket off. I can't hear myself think. Turn the radio off. That's much better. This game looks so very good, church. to be honest. It's Sunday already. Eyes on the road. <laughs> like, very good. I've never played Mafia 1 before, but I thought I'd. The game looked very good from the videos I've seen of early footage and stuff like that, so I thought well, I'll give it a go, you know what I mean? I haven't really done many of these kind of videos with commentary or anything like that, so it's a bit rusty at the minute, a bit new of all this kind of thing. I thought I'd turn the radio off, well, I can still friggin' yar it. The only tip I'll give you is to stop smoking in your vehicle. I felt like I was sitting in an ash tree. Sure, whatever you say. Cheeky bastards! Right, search for another fair, right. I think I'll just keep that speed limit on for a second. Just walking in the middle of the bloody road, I want to see if I can get bloody run out or something. So this game I think is set in the 1920s, 30s, maybe 40s. Not really not fair here. Oh, the timer. Right, let's turn that off. Cheeky bastard! Twenty-six seconds left. Here we go. Thanks, Fifty cents. Fifty cents. Too bad. Fifteen cents first. Five each additional. Wait till we've got enough for another fair, I'm guessing. Oh boy, you look like shit. I 
I've been working since five. What's your excuse? Move. Figures. Where are we going? Little Italy. Okay. If I don't can't even play himself, but we win. You don't tell him when I break the limit. Good deal. Great deal. Got any fairs today? Yeah, some. But never enough of them. Who's got the money for cab rides since the market tank that all went to shit, I guess. The only reason I got you taking me places is I'm drunk and don't know better. Can't see enough drunk fellas. They're only after the people moving it and selling it. Yeah, but I've seen you go after guys for less. Yes, yeah, so if they think they can shake something out of you, they will use any excuse. This city's corrupt as all hell. Sure is. Yeah, so I started this YouTube channel, I think it was about three years back now. Maybe it's around about that, but I haven't really been doing much, I haven't done any of these kind of videos at all in them three years, so... Hope that you enjoy these videos. If you want to see more of this vi these um, kind of videos, I'll then just hit that like button. The more likes you get, the more I'll know that people are enjoying these kind of videos, basically. I'm also done The Last of Us 2 walkthrough, but obviously I haven't actually completed that yet. Well, I mean, I'm hoping that I can complete this walkthrough first and then I'll go back to The Last of Us 2 one, if that's what people enjoy really. I'll just put that limiter on a minute while the police are just there. there. <coughs> How you doing, pal? You remember me? Yeah? Huh? Mr. Morello's a little bent. Shouldn't go help him sell Yeri's goons, huh? I'm gonna have to give you a beating. Just so you always remember who runs this town. Make it so you won't do much locking for a while, eh? <laughs> Look at this guy. I didn't think he'd make it fun. Let's get him. Holy shit, let's go, motherfucker. Come on, grab your fucking way. Press the triangle at the vault. Let's go. Go, go, go. Right, this way, I'm guessing. Holy shit. Run, bitch! That's uh, where. Let's go. Oh shit! Which way then? This way. Oh, spamming that triangle button there. Well, come on, move. Let's go. Let's go, bitch. How you doing, kid? Dino, Lou, you got business with the Don? Nah, we just trying to talk to that cabbie over there. That's all. That right? Yeah. Well, this here's the Don's favorite driver. So anything you got to say to him, you can say to me. Is that right? Well, I'll tell you something, pal. We ain't leaving empty-handed, that's for sure. Well, then maybe you ain't leaving at all. OK, then. 
see your boys around. Let's go, Lou. Thanks. At least we could do. Come on. Let's go say hi to the Don. Don Silieri? Yeah. He's gonna want to hear about this. I'm just gonna leave this um, video where it is now. Hopefully, you all come back for a um, part two if any of you are watching this. <laughs> right, thank you for watching. See ya!